Hey everybody, Alex from Android Central here, and we've got two Galaxy Nexus that we want to show you. One's running Jelly Bean, Android 4.1, the other one's running Ice Cream Sandwich, the old Android 4.0. Um, so there are a few differences we want to show you here, and it starts off with a lock screen. As you'll see, a uh, different effect when we're scrolling around on the lock screen. A uh, new option right up top, and that's for Google Now. So we scroll all the way up, let's put this old Nexus away, and we get some new information here, uh, relevant to where we are, and I guess our calendar and other stuff. So we're in San Francisco right now, we've got weather and some other stuff. And of course as we build up more information as our search history grows uh, we'll get yet more relevant information in this uh, app. So uh, we'll have to take a look at that later on and see how that develops. Um, so back to the launcher and another major new feature of ICS is the way things have been sped up and the way responsiveness to touch and general speed in the UI um, has been improved. So it uses tricks like vSync, uh, triple buffering, and ramping up the CPU speed when you touch the screen to give a really nice uh, improvement in uh, perceived performance, really. Uh, one area really, where you really notice this is the task switcher. That's pretty much instant, even with all this stuff in the app drawer, and that's just something you would not get an ice cream sandwich. Um, we've also got some new notification stuff. The notification area at the top has been more or less completely redesigned, and we've got these new areas here where we can uh, essentially get um, widget-like functionality in these notifications. We've got one for Google Now, we've got the current weather, uh, we've also got this large one here for the screenshot we've just recently captured. Uh, we've also got a new version of Google Search and you'll see the uh, persistent search button up here in the uh, launcher has changed a little bit as well. We've got this white background. Um, so go up in here and it uses knowledge engines and stuff and we'll just tap on one in our history. So we're searching for the capital of France and it should understand what we mean by that and sure enough we've got information on Paris there. We can also use voice as well, so let's try that. Who's the president of France? And after a while, normally this is pretty fast, and there we go, Francois Hollande. And so, uh, yeah, that's just about right, so that's pretty cool. And it's uh, comparing this to Samsung's S voice, the difference in quality is really pretty impressive. Uh, accuracy is much improved, and the general speed of it is uh, pretty impressive as well. Uh, so we've got a few new Google apps in here as well, and these are actually available to download now on ICS devices as well. We've got a revamped uh, YouTube app, which we'll see right here. Taking a while to sign in, but we've got this thing at the side where we can uh, view all our subscriptions, and then we've got the main view in the middle there for all our channels. Uh, so we hop out of that, we've also got the new Google Plus app. That's been redesigned once again, actually. We've got all this stuff. We can scroll down this really nice sort of visual arrangement of stuff in here too. So heading back to the launcher, uh, we can check out a new feature in this new version of Android. And we've actually got a second Galaxy Nexus here running uh, Jelly Bean. And we can actually beam content across from one to the other. So let's just load up a picture in the Gallery app and actually use our launcher uh, shortcut here. Hold them back to back and they make the noise. Tap the screen on one. And we've got an incoming beam there on the other. You can see the notification up at the top. So. Uh, there we go, we've also got some new Google Play features and uh, the big new one they were talking about today is Play Magazines, that's a new addition. Um, so you've got the uh, app starting up here, obviously not too much uh, in the way of content just yet, but this is going to be a big focus for Google in uh, the near future. So we're just launching into Google Play Store now, we can add stuff to populate our magazine layout. Um, so anyway, there you go, very quick look at Android 4.1 Jelly Bean on the Samsung Galaxy Nexus. Thanks for watching.